generally speaking, generally speaking, we have public and personal personas. This is much more prevalent in Asia, probably most pronounced in Japan, a little less so in Korea, and in America we pretty much let it all hang out, but we do still have ideas that we don't express in public and words that we don't express in public when we're trying to be polite and maintain decorum. For example, whatever you happen to do in your bedroom, you probably shouldn't be talking about with strangers at the bus stop. We generally don't use certain words in mixed company. We don't wear sneakers on the Senate floor, I would imagine. We dress a certain way when we go to church, synagogue, or mosque. My point is, there is ample evidence to say that certain things we shouldn't do in public. So, if you can agree to that, maybe you can agree to the idea that certain superstitious and insulting and harmful ideas shouldn't be expressed in public. For example, if you hold to superstitious and harmful ideas such as the earth is flat, or that global climate change isn't adversely affected to a large degree by humanity, or that you think people of other natural persuasions aren't entitled to the same equal rights. All of these things go against science, common sense, and decency, and so probably shouldn't be expressed in public either. Here's my conclusion. If you're running for office and you make a campaign foundation upon certain offensive, harmful, and superstitious ideas, you should probably be disqualified from office as you would be if you insisted on coming to the Senate floor in sneakers or if you kept discussing your sexual behavior in front of the other members of the government or if you were constantly rude. Make sense? Have a nice day.